Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. In this video, we are going to learn how to host our Flutter web app on GitHub pages. GitHub provides us a free web hosting service. Currently, my app is running on localhost. This is only accessible from my device. Now we make it this app globally accessible by the use of GitHub. To deploy our app on GitHub pages, type this command flutter build web it generates all the required assets for our web app to deploy on it takes some time wait until it it provides us all the required file that we need we have successfully built our web folder inside our build let's check it You can see all the required accessory are is in the web folder. We don't need all this folder. We have only need this web folder for our web hosting. After creating web folder inside the build folder. Now we have go to the GitHub. And create your new repository. Before creating a new repository, keep in mind you have already logged in by creating your account repository name and another thing you need to keep in your mind your repository name starting from your username it's like this is my username and dot github dot io your github username dot github dot io is your repository name otherwise you face error and create repository There are two ways to upload your file. One is upload an existing file. This is the easiest way. Everyone can upload by using this. Click on upload an existing file and drag the file inside the web folder and commit change. But in this video, I will show you how to upload our file by using this command. Uploading an existing file is the easiest way. You can easily upload this. Keep in mind only up upload an existing file inside the web folder cd build slash and cd web after that we are is in the web folder now web is our root directory and you can copy this all command and edit it git init git add dot commit manually you copy one by one paste the command last git push we have push our all the file inside the web folder. You can see we have successfully uploaded all the file inside the web folder. If you upload all the file, then your website is quite slow because there is the lots of file. More file takes more time to upload. After that. We refresh our repo and you can see all the required assets are is in there and keep in mind we have only one main branch after uploading all this file we have go to setting and here this is the pages click on this By default, deploy from the branch is here. If you are more than one branch, then you need to choose main branch and save it. After you have saving, it provide the site for you. Your site is live it. After your site is live it here, so in your screen, then visit this site. You can see our website is live globally. 
you can visit this side by use of this link. We have copied this and we have opened the new window. And if we try to paste it here, you can see, you can see our website is live globally. By the use of this link, you can also visit in my site. I'll provide this link in my video description and you will try. By the use of this way, you can easily host your web app on GitHub pages. After watching this video, I hope you have learned lots of things about how to host your website in GitHub.